Hi everyone, hope all is well. Uh, I have some uh, frequently asked questions here about Windows 10. When is Windows 10 releasing? It's 29th of July. What's up with the free upgrade? Is it free? Yes, Windows 10 is free for one year if you are upgrading from Windows 8.1 or Windows 7 Service Pack 1. If you have XP or Windows Vista, you need to um, purchase Windows 7 or Windows 8.1 or an upgrade or you can purchase Windows 10. Will I only have Windows 10 for one year and then I have to pay? No, it's absolutely free. But you got to upgrade your Windows from uh, one within one year from the release date. Will the free upgrade lose functionality? No, never. Will the technical preview uh, will be automatically up upgraded to full version? No. What will I lose in the upgrade? Well, Microsoft stay says, yeah, all your files and folders will be intact. You won't lose any of your files. Will it be, will it be available as an ISO? Um, yes and no, uh, but to get the ISO, you need to register and install the upgrade first. Then you would be able to download the ISO file. How much is the full install cost? If you want to buy outright, it costs you $119 for home premium and $199 for professional version. Can I use the same license keys as before? Yes. You Windows 10 essentially takes your existing license uh, and uses it for the upgrade. So for example, if you upgraded your Windows 8 from Windows 7, you may want to um, use the Windows 7. Can I downgrade Windows 10 to a previous version? Absolutely. You can downgrade Windows 7, uh, sorry, Windows 10 to a previous version, but if you um, upgraded from Windows 8.1 to Windows 10 and you're in Windows 8.1 is upgraded from Windows 7, then you will have to go back all the way to Windows 7 and then upgrade again to Windows 8.1. Is the free upgrade only for home version? No, free upgrade is uh, for all the versions. If you have home version, you will get home version free. If you have professional, you will get professional. I have XP or Windows Vista and uh, am I eligible to upgrade? No, unfortunately not. You need to um, buy a fresh copy. Can I deploy Windows 10? Again, this is for IT administrators. Uh, yes, you can deploy Windows 10. Will Windows Server 2008 and Server 2012 support Windows 10? And again, this is a question for IT administrators. Yes. What about my partitions? Right, up upgrade will only affect the partition where the operating system is installed. So if your Windows 7 is installed on C drive, you only your C drive will be affected. Check out my other video um, to see the, what are the new features in Windows 10. Thanks for watching. If you uh, like my video, uh, please hit like button below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.